Hi, this lesson is about basic Japanese hiragana. There are 46 traditional Japanese letters to learn in this lesson. So let's get started. We're going to learn them in groups. The first group is the basic vowels of the Japanese language. They are a, i, u, e, o. A as in father, a, i as in eat, i, u as in the double o in English, u, and then e as in the word set, e. And then O as in the word old. So O, A, I, U, E, O. The second group, we're just going to add the consonant K in front of the five basic vowels. So that are Ka, Ki, Ku, Ke, Ko. So remember the five vowels are A, I, U, E, O. So when adding in the K is ka, ki, ku, ke, ko. The third group is the S consonant. So we have sa, si, su, se, so. The word si is a bit special. It's written as S-H-I. So we're going to pronounce as si. It's different from the English word she, so you're going to start your sound with a fake smile, clutching teeth, and push a little bit of air out of your uh, teeth. So that is she, she. So the famous food uh, sushi is not really pronounced as sushi in Japanese. It is sushi, sushi. The third group we have the consonant T. So they are ta chi tsu te to. So notice here we have two special ones. The first one is chi is written as ch, not t. So try saying chi ta, that is chi. And for tsu is the ending sound of cats, adding in the u sound. So tsu tsu. Ta, chi, tsu, te, to. This group is straightforward. It's just the consonant n. So, na, ni, nu, ne, no. Again, na, ni, nu, ne, no. The next group is the consonant h. So we have ha, hi, hu, he. Ho. So notice the, the middle word hu. It is written in either hu or fu. So the pronunciation is kind of in between h and f. Hu. Hu. This group is straightforward again. It's just the consonant m. So they are ma, mi, mu, me, mo. Again, ma, mi, mu, me, mo. Just be careful of the word me. So when you see me, don't try to pronounce as me, but as me. The Y column will only have three letters. They are ya, you, yo. So because the missing two are the same as the basic vowels, e and e. So again, ya, yu, yo. So in this group, we have the special R column. So it's different from the English R. So try to think in, in between English R and English L. So la, li, lu, le, lo. La, li, lu, le, lo. So tempura actually it's pronounced as tempura. The last group we only have three again, so they are wa, wo, n. So the last one is a nasal consonant. N. N is not used alone, but only appear at the end of the words as an ending sound. For example, in the word me. 
mm, men, that is noodle. So these are the basic 46 hiraganas. So get used to them and you are going to start reading Japanese straight away. This lesson is about Japanese dakuon hiragana. So what is dakuon exactly? Actually, it's just variations of basic hiraganas by changing the consonant letters. In the basic hiraganas, all the consonants are like k, t. So we're not vibrating our vocal cord. So in this time, we're going to make some sounds like g, z. So let's get started. The first group, the original basic hiraganas we have, ka, ki, ku, ke, ko. So the consonant is k. But this time, we're going to add in the double dot and make it g. So the sounds become ga, gi, gu, ge, go, ga, gi, gu, ge, go. Just make sure you don't exert too much emphasis on the e sound. So it's not gi, but it's gi. The second group we have the original as sa, si, su, se, so. So here we're going to change the s to z, so making z the buzzing sound, and notice the double dots on the right hand corner as well. So we have z, 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 z. Again, z, 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 z. The third group we have the t column changing to the d column. So original we have ta chi su te to and changing to da kuon we have da ji su de do so notice the ji and zi they have the same pronunciation as the previous group ji and zi again da ji su de do in the fourth group, we have the H column becomes the B column. So originally, we have ha, he, hu, he, ho. And the dakuon will be ba, bi, bu, be, bo. Again, ba, bi, bu, be, bo. The last group, we call it hang dakuon. And it is not written as double dot, but a circle on the top right hand corner. So here, we're changing the H column to the P column. So originally we have HA, HE, HU, HE, HO. Changing to the HANG DAKUON, we have PA, PI, PU, PE, PO, PA. Pi, pu, pe, po. And these are the dakuon and hang dakuon letters of the hiragana. If you find it difficult, go back to the basic 46 hiragana and do revision, and these will become easier. Bye! This lesson is about Japanese yo on hiragana, the 36 combo hiragana letters. Let's get started. How do we make the combinations or the combo hiragana letters? It's just by combining all the hiragana letters ending with the vowel i and with the ya, yu, yo, we have the combo hiraganas. The rule is really simple. The only thing you need to pay attention to is the pronunciation, as many of the pronunciations we don't really have an equivalent counterpart in the English language. The first group we have ki plus ya, yu, yo. If you notice when we write the combo hiragana or the yo on, we have to write the first hiragana bigger and with the second ya, yu, yu being smaller or half sized. And we have to pronounce them together. Instead of ki ya, we pronounce as kya. Ki yu becomes kyu. Ki yo becomes kyo. 
kya, kyu, kyo, kyo. The second group we have si plus ya, yu, yo. So we pronounce them together as xia, xiu, xiu. Again, xia, xiu, xiu. Next, we have qi plus ya, yu, yo. Becomes qia, qiu, qiu. Again, qia, qiu, qiu. Ni plus ya, yu, yo. Nya, nyu, nyo. Nya, nyu, nyo. Next, he plus ya, yu, yo. We have hya, hyu, hyo. Again, hya, hyu, hyo. Mi plus ya, yu, yo. Mya, myu, myo. Nya. Miu, miu. Next, we have li plus ya, yu, yo. So remember the R in Japanese is in between R and L. So again, we have lia, liu, liu. Lia, liu, liu. Next, we have the dakuong letters plus the ya, yu, yo. So start with ki, so kya. Gyu, gyo, gya, gyu, gyo. So she with double dot pronounces ji plus ya, yu, yo. We have jia, ju, yo. Jia, ju, yo. The dakuon of ji, ji plus ya, yu, yo. So becomes jia, ju, Jo, jia, ju, jo. Again, it is the same as the previous ji, the xi with double dot. The last dakuon letters we have bi, so the he plus double dot is bi, so plus ya, yu, yo. We have bia, biu, biu. Again, bia, biu, biu. Last one, we have the Han Dakon letter P, so P plus Ya, Yu, Yo. We have Pia, Piu, Pio, Pia, Piu, Pio. These are the Yo on Hiraganas. They might be tongue twisters at first, but don't worry, just keep practicing and you get there. Bye!